Hello and thank you for joining Pro Surf Blog for this epic surf news update for November 2014. On November 5th, the Association of Surfing Professionals announced a restructure and rebranding action for the qualifying series that will take effect in 2015. In 2015, the Association of Surfing Professionals will be known as the World Surf League, but in addition to that change, there will be another change in the structure of the qualifying series point system. Moving forward, the former seven levels of the QS events will become five, with the naming designation centered around the new point offerings. So the rundown is one star becomes a QS 1000, the two and three star merge become the QS 1500, the four star and five star merge become the QS 3000, and the six star becomes the QS 6000, prime becoming the QS 10,000. So those numbers after the letters QS signify the amount of points available. And personally I think this will be better to tie the surf audience with the qualifying series path used for competitors. Then on November 13th, the 2014 Reef Hawaiian Pro and ASP Qualifying Series Prime Rated event kicked off with locals blasting into the air. And you can see Kailani David here clearing this huge gap. The Reef Hawaiian Pro culminated on November 15th with Dusty Payne conquering a long list of gladiators to win this epic event. What is also amazing is Dusty Payne had recently recovered from a couple injuries. I would also recommend watching Heats on Demand for Julian Wilson. Jay Wilson was in impeccable form throughout this entire event. Five days later, on November 20th, Pro Surf Blog did a surf check down at the Oceanside Harbor, and then we're going to move on to the next segment. Good morning, and thank you for joining Pro Surf Blog today for this surf check at the Oceanside Harbor. We're over at the North Jetty, and the waves are not perfect, but there's definitely size in the water. Uh, there might be some better spots up and down the coast, but enjoy a few minutes of what you got. On November 22nd, 2014, we moved on to the Surfing Santa Contest that took place at Legendary Salt Creek, California. This event was held in support of Surfers Healing, had everything from sledding to surfing aerials. Peep these snippets from that day and visit our surf channel to see the complete collection of Surfing Santa videos.
Then on November 25th, 2014, the Vans World Cup of Surfing kicked off at Sunset Beach, Oahu. Locals like Kai Barger were running it. Uh, this event did not complete until December 2014, so check back for our December edition of Epic Surf News to get the results from the 2014 Sunset Beach Comp. Then on to November 27, 2014, we island hop over for the Women's World Tour event in Maui, which was already into the quarterfinals by this point. Chris Moore had to break through Joanne DeFay in order to win the Maui World Tour event, and Stephanie Gilmore earned enough season points to claim the 2014 ASP Women's World Tour title while this event was taking place. Congrats to both of those ladies. Thanks again for watching our November 2014 Epic Surf News Edition, and please share this video with a friend.